welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another vlog. In today's video, it is gonna be an Amazon haul slash Amazon favorites. These are some things that I've purchased over the past, like I wanna say maybe three months and I've been loving, but I'm also gonna be sharing some things that are new. But like when you know, you know, like I know I'm gonna be using these things from here on out. So I might as well put it in today's video and share it with you all. If you are new here, I post all things home content, home updates, hauls, interior design tips, and some Amazon favorites. I post a lot more on Instagram and TikTok pretty much every single day. So if you want little like sneak peeks and snippets of what our weekly videos are going to be, definitely head over there, give me a follow. If you're obsessed with all things home, like I am, you're definitely gonna love the content over there. So with all that being said, if you wanna see what some of my Amazon favorites are, as well as some new purchases, just basically a all things home Amazon video Video, then please just keep on watching. Okay, you guys, so the first thing I wanna talk about is this gorgeous, and I mean gorgeous. Like, I'm telling you, if you work from home or maybe you are like a homebody, this is gonna be for you. It is this acrylic bed tray, you guys. It's the simple things. You could definitely go to a different store and get like a wooden one. You could definitely just put your laptop on your lap in bed, sure. I mean, it's gonna heat up. It's not gonna be as comfortable. It's not gonna be as aesthetic, but if you're anything like me, you need this acrylic bed tray. It is so chic. It literally makes me want to work more. It makes me want to just like post a picture on Instagram because it is so aesthetic. I have my hot chocolate with marshmallows and some sprinkles on top to just like set the vibe. I'm all about romanticizing my life and just making small little moments special. And I feel like this acrylic bed tray just makes me feel special. I'll have my iPad up, watching a Christmas movie, doing some work, maybe maybe just on Pinterest, like relaxing with like a hot tea. It is a vibe. It's so cozy. I don't know, maybe it's not, it's acrylic. So like how cozy can it be? There's something about it that feels cozy in my mind and I love it. It's very sturdy. I just love it. It's very chic and you just have to have it. In my opinion, this is a must have. Okay, item number two is this clothing rack again. And I feel like I'm gonna say this for every single product. It's just the little things that make your life a little bit more like chic and polished looking and this clothing rack is definitely one of those. I wanted this one because the spot in my glam room is very narrow and I just needed one that was narrow enough to fit up against that wall. I'm sure you could get bigger ones and I'm pretty sure this one comes in different sizes as well. But I like this one because of the size. I like it because it's gold and marble and it fits the aesthetic of the space. But there's also parts of the clothing rack that kind of like protrude out where you can hang up your clothes on the ends and you can add like accessories. Like maybe if you wanna add like a handbag. I think this is great. I'm really trying to get into the habit of having clothes out that maybe are new that I just purchased or picking out my outfits for the week or just having a collection out that I'm like, all right, before I go and grab these sweatpants and sweat <laughs> shirts, let me look at the clothing rack at like the clothes that I actually have that are more like put together and try to style an outfit around that. That's where this came from. This outfit came from that clothing rack. I just had like a white button up shirt and I was like, you know what? Let me try to like make that work. So yeah, if you're trying to, you know, step up your fashion game a little bit, having a clothing rack out on display so that you can see all of your your items, all of your pieces. You can put your shoes at the bottom, put a handbag on the side. You just feel like, okay, let me reach for that instead of just those sweatpants that I always wear. Okay, and item number three is, again, something that I keep like in the glam room, in my glam room closet, and it's this gold stool. <sighs> you don't need. These are not really needs in my life, they're needs, but they might not be needs. You need a gold stool. In my opinion, you need a gold stool. It's so chic. It's like, it's sturdy, it's secure. If you are little like me, I'm only 5'2", so like I need a step stool pretty much in every single room. Like I can't reach anything. So I need step stools and this is like key for me. It's gold, it's sturdy, it's secure. I'm able to reach things like up high, pretty much anything that I need to reach. And yeah, it's just chic, it matches with the closet, it goes with the vibe. Again, it's all about romanticizing your life and a gold step stool just like feels, it's just girly. It's just chic and it's girly and I really, really like it. Okay, and item number four is actually something that I use in the living room and that is this 
cup holder slash phone like rest, I guess you could say. I purchased one of these and as soon as it came in the mail and I started using it, I immediately purchased another one. I keep this on my side of the couch, but the other one I keep in the sunroom. Honestly, I move it around sometimes because sometimes I wanna be on the other side and I need it. Like I need to have my phone right there. I need to have like my cup of water, my tea, maybe on the weekends, like a little glass of wine in the cup holder. And it just feels, it's just very functional, but it's also very chic as well. So I'm able to watch a Christmas movie, have my hot cocoa, have my phone right there. Maybe I wanna take it out, post on stories and then drink my hot chocolate and I'm cozy and I'm comfortable and I have everything I need. I don't have to worry about like my cups spilling over or like holding it the whole time or putting it back. We have a table back here behind our couch. So putting it back here and then trying to like balance it to bring it over is a little risky, but having it next to me, like I just feel more secure. And plus I always have a blanket on me. So the likelihood of some spillage happening is very, very small. So I just really, really like this. It has a gold rim around it. It has like these weighted ends. So it's not like flip flopping around on the corner of the couch. It's very secure, very cute, very functional, very necessary. Okay, and moving on to the fifth item, I feel like all of these things are very much like <laughs> gold. Like I feel like the theme of this is very just like gold and chic. But the next thing is a carafe. And if you have never heard of a carafe, you're probably like, what are you talking about? It's basically like a container that you can keep your water, but it also comes with cups that you can put on top so that none of like the, I don't know, like debris from the air. Like, you know how sometimes there's like floaties and lint and stuff like that. It doesn't settle in your water. It's very, very chic. You can keep this on your bedside and like drink water in the middle of the night if you wake up thirsty. But for me personally, in the middle of the night, I'm not gonna pour this glass thing and like drink water. Like, I don't know. For me, it's like if I'm waking up in the middle of the night, I'm going to the bathroom, I'm jumping right back in the bed and I'm knocking out. So how I like to use this is pouring water in the carafe part at night. And then when I wake up in the morning, having water to drink first thing in the morning, because I don't know about you, but I always wake up like super thirsty and feeling really dehydrated. It's probably not a good sign. I probably need to drink more water like throughout the day, but I just like having water first thing in the morning. And they say you're supposed to drink room temperature water. You're not supposed to have like ice cold water, even though I love that. This carafe is perfect. You can pour your water and drink it in the morning and just like start your day. You can also have this like if you work from home in your office and it'll keep you like, I don't know, drinking more water. It's just chic. It's just very, very chic. It's a very nice way to drink water. And yeah, I just really, really like it. It's pretty, it's cute and I just love it. Okay, so we are still in the Christmas season. We are like in the thick of it, I feel, but I wanted to talk about some lights that I got from Amazon that I, I'm so happy I got these. I'm in love with these. So first up are these simple stems that you can add to any like floral arrangement or any vase. If you have like Christmas specific stems, like a cypress or like an evergreen, like that type of greenery, you can add these stems to your vase and it just looks really, really chic. It makes it look a little bit more like magical and whimsical and I really like that effect. So I have these in my bathroom and I'm telling you, you guys like at night, okay, this is like the scene that I set for myself. At night, I make sure like all of the lights are off except for the Christmas lights. So the trees, like our little twinkly lights that we have all around, just like our Christmas lights. And then in the bathroom, I will have a candle lit plus these lit up stems. And there's something about it that like, I don't know, you wouldn't think like making a bathroom special is like a big deal. But when you're sitting like watching a movie and then like you need to go to the bathroom, I don't know, it's just a vibe. Like it just feels cozy. It feels like a hotel in a sense. I don't know how to describe it, but like when you go in there and it's like whimsical and like the candle is lit and then you come back out into the living room and that feels Christmassy. It's like a whole experience. Like for me, I'm just big on like the experience of things, romanticizing things. So when I'm watching a Christmas movie and I have my Christmas lights on and I take a bathroom break and that's whimsical as well. I don't have to turn on these bright lights. Like any place I go is very whimsical. I feel like I'm in a Christmas oasis. Like I feel like I'm in another world. Like it just feels really good. <laughs> so yeah, you need these stems. I just really like them. And the other lights that I'm obsessed with are these faux tree branches. They're like lit branches, basically. It's a tree. It looks like a tree. It's just stems and they're lit up. I don't even know if 
I did a good job describing that. But basically they're like these lit branches. I'll call them like lit branches. The other ones were lit stems. These are lit branches because it's like a tree. And they come in three different sizes. I have one in the sunroom, one in the living room, and one upstairs in the glam room. I love these. These to me are like Christmas magic in a tree. It is so chic when it's nighttime, you know it's getting dark quick now. So having these like lit up, it makes the time change not so rough because you have things to look forward to. I don't know if that makes sense. But anyway, like I said, I'm romanticizing life and I really, really like these items. Okay, the next thing I wanna talk about are coffee table books. I have an Amazon storefront, which I'll link down below, obviously, but I have a section on my storefront that is all about coffee table books. I have searched high and low and found the most chic, aesthetic coffee table books. If you get it, you get it. They're all very neutral. They're all very vibey. That's where I get the majority of my coffee table books. Obviously you can go into like a bookstore, a local bookstore would be a better option. We don't really have like things like that around here. Or if we do, it's not going to be like chic books. They're going to be kind of like toe up from the flow up if you get what I'm saying. So I just hit up Amazon. I can always find the coffee table books that I want for affordable prices over there. I have pretty much coffee table books in every single room. And I'm going to say they're either from Hobby Lobby or Amazon. Those are like the only two places I get my coffee table books. I feel like Amazon has a wide variety of different like, like topics and aesthetics of them, if that makes sense. Like I got some like winter ones more interior design ones, some New York ones, some fashion books, and I just really like them. So I will have them linked down below. I feel like every single room needs a coffee table book. Coffee table or not, you need a book. Okay, so this next item is kind of a little bit of a splurge, but I feel like it's worth it because this time of year, if you're buying like more expensive ornaments, if your ornaments are glass, if your ornaments are sentimental, I know for me a lot, well, honestly, the majority of my ornaments on our main tree are from Crate and Barrel or CB2, and I want to prolong them as long as I can. So I purchased last year this ornament organizer. It's gray, it's aesthetic, <laughs> but it's also such great quality. So it comes as like a zip box, but inside there's like different like layers where you can keep your ornaments in. You kind of put it together. There's like small little sections and you're able to keep each ornament in its own little section on its own little like, um, not a tray, like a tray thing. And there's like maybe three or four inside the entire compartment itself. And I just love the fact that it's very secure. There's like padding, like it's metal support pieces inside. And you're able to like store your ornaments, keep them safe, keep them secure. There's like a zipper in the front where you can put maybe like your ribbon or tinsel, if you use tinsel or maybe even some lights, whatever it is, like special items in the front, you can label it. There's like a little like label section. I just think this is great. This is very necessary for those of you who, like I said, have glass ornaments, nice ornaments, maybe family ornaments that you pass down. I only bought one last year and I got three more this year because we have ornaments in the kids rooms and the playroom. Even though those ornaments are not glass, I still just want to keep my things nice and organized. So I have four total, one for each tree, except the living room and the office. They share one because I don't have that many ornaments in my office. I kept it very minimal this year. But I just think this is a necessity. I'm so glad I purchased this, like two thumbs up, five stars, 10 out of 10 recommend. Okay, so next up are smart plugs. I have so many trees in my house. Well, not so many. I have five actual Christmas trees and then I have those three lit branches that I was telling you about. So I have a total of like eight technically like Christmassy trees. And for me to go around and plug in each one or press the button for each one, like it doesn't sound like a lot. Like it's it's like you just press a button eight times. Like it's not that big of a deal, but to be plugging them in, like it's just like a hassle. So I decided to get smart plugs this year. So I have them on every single tree. Anything that's like Christmas related has a smart plug attached to it. I set it up with my Alexa. I won't say it too loud, but she's all hooked up. We're good to go. I have the app on my phone, like the Alexa app on my phone. I can tell her set the Christmas vibe. That's our phrase that we use. And then everything turns on or we tell her turn off the North Pole. So those are our two little sayings. <laughs> and one is for the beginning of the day to turn it all on. And one is for the end of the day to turn it off. Even though really we have a schedule set up with these plugs as well. You guys,
guys, I know it sounds like a lot, but once you set it up and get the hang of it, it's genius. It's like life changing. So we have a schedule from 8 a.m. to I think around like midnight. Yeah, I think it's from like 8 a.m. to midnight that the indoor Christmas lights and trees turn on. But we have those phrases just in case like I don't want the schedule or we want to turn it off earlier. It's just so handy. It's just so great, especially this time of the year. Like you don't want to worry about like, oh, I forgot to turn the tree on or, you know, our outdoor lights aren't on, which has a separate schedule as well. So our outdoor lights are like 5.30 to, I think maybe they go off around like 2 a.m. I'm not too sure. But basically the nighttime hours is when the outdoor lights are on and we have a schedule for that. And then the daylight hours is when the inside lights are on. I don't know if that makes sense. That's a lot. But basically we have our routine and our schedule for all of our Christmas lights. We don't have to think about it. They come on when they come on, they turn off when they turn off. And it's just one less thing we have to think about. So I highly recommend them. They come in a pack of two. I think I got like five packs, something like that. I went a little crazy, but we actually ended up using them all. So I guess it was good. So yeah, it's just really, really handy. Cannot recommend them enough. So yeah, you guys, those are all of my Amazon home slash lifestyle favorites slash haul. <laughs> a lot of things in there. I will have my Amazon storefront linked down below. Definitely go over and follow me on Instagram and TikTok. We are, and a lot of you all are, because we're growing rapidly. Like YouTube is becoming like my smallest social media account, which is crazy. So definitely head over there. I'm showing things nonstop every single day. If you want a sneak peek, like I said, for this week's video, I'm gonna be doing that over on Instagram Reels and TikTok. So with all that being said, I really hope you all enjoyed today's video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe, hit that bell notification so you never miss an upload. And we, all of my Amazon favorites, we will see you all in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.